Good afternoon, I'm Jeff. I'm a sewer tech northwest. Today we're at property address 1580 Southeast Evans Avenue here in Troutdale. We're located at the front of the home. We're off to the right of the front doorway. Right smack dab behind this tree here that's grown up against the house. There's a three inch ABS clean out right behind it. This will be our point of access. I'm going to insert the camera and check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. We currently have water running. Here we go. It just transitioned there at 31 feet over to schedule 3034 PVC pipe. Looks like it's transitioning here. It's kind of hard to see there, but it looks like it's switching to six inch pipe. And here at 63 feet out, we have reached the main lateral. I'm going to do locates real quick just to verify which street this line goes out to. Yeah, located the camera head successfully. The line goes out to the main lateral on Southeast Evans Avenue. Pipe's totally drained out at this point. All right, I'm just about to reel the camera out of the line. We've got great flow all the way out to the main lateral, the ABS and PVC portions of the line. So this is the only spot here that's slightly in question. It looks like a piece of dental floss is stuck there. On the way out, I thought that might be a root from the tree in front of the line here, but that is not a root there. That's just some string. So anyway, there is some discoloration at the top of the pipe there. Uh, there is a tree basically smack dab over the sewer line, only about eight inches to a foot in front of the clean out. Uh, it's possible that the roots uh, have caused the pipe there on the top of the line to crack, and that's what's allowing a little bit of dirt to come through. This is this is we're only one foot in the line, so this is directly essentially beneath where the where that tree is at. Um, at this time, I can't see any other indicators that there's damage or roots there. There's no roots protruding out from that, um, so it's really hard to say. Sometimes you'll just get debris stuck at a certain part of the line there, and, and that's all it is. Um, so anyway, I can't confirm anything at this point. I don't see any obvious issues going on there. So anyway, we've got good flow all the way out to the main lateral. Apart from this one little spot right here that, that I, I can't really diagnose unless it were to be hydrojetted and cleaned to expose the plastic there. Um, I, I, I can't really tell you what's going on. It could be debris, could be 
uh, a crack there from the roots uh, allowing some dirt to come through but at this time the line is functioning properly no issues there so uh, if you're concerned I would do a rescope in a year or two to see if anything has changed the good part is it's only a foot out from the clean out it's at its shallowest point um, you would have to remove the tree uh, and honestly this tree is growing up right next to the house it would probably be a good idea to get this thing away from the home as it's it's probably trapping moisture against the siding but either way it's a, a very simple fix if it were to require one at this time I don't recommend any repairs the line is functioning at this time